Leonard Fournette was the number one running back in the 2014 high school class. Out of Louisiana, he had offers from all over the country, but decided to stay with the home state LSU Tigers. Standing at 6'1", 235 pounds, Fournette is a thickly built man with a very powerful lower half. He is a north to south downhill runner with an upright running style. He loves contact and does a great job of lowering his center of gravity to meet defenders in the hole. He keeps his feet moving and runs with a good forward lean to gain yards after he's tackled. He is a team player and chases down defenders for tackles after his quarterback makes a costly error. Out of all the prospects in this class, he is my number one running back based on his upside, power, and breakaway speed. While he is a large running back with excellent speed, I have concerns with his durability. An ankle injury that he suffered at the start of the season nagged him for his final year at LSU. Additionally, based on his upright running style and powerful lower half, defenders will consistently aim low at his feet and knees in order to bring him down. For his power, he was tripped easily where other running backs would be able to slip these ankle tackles based on his high center of gravity. With his running style, he hits the hole hard, but he's a bit stiff in the hips. If a defender can stop his momentum in the backfield or at the line of scrimmage, he doesn't have the flexibility to turn in quickly to gain it back. At LSU, he ran a mixture of zone and gap style concepts, namely isolation, inside zones, and toss plays to get him to the edge. If I was an offensive coordinator, I would not run him on any outside running play from shotgun. He doesn't have the hip flexibility nor the running style to support the angles required to hit the hole properly. He would be much better at running from single back, offset eye, or eye formation with a full back to get his momentum going north to south. He is a workhorse back with average hands out of the backfield. LSU did not use him as a receiver very often, but used him in pass protection to help the offensive line. With his size, he is an above average blocker, but he struggles in space due to his hip flexibility. Finding a direct parallel for his size and power is very difficult, but I think Adrian Peterson of the current modern era of running backs fits him the best. Peterson ran a 4-4, 40-yard dash at 6'1", 217 pounds, and while I see Fournette as a 4-5 guy, you have to remember that he is running it at close to 20 pounds heavier, so that's even more impressive in my opinion. Overall, I give him a top 10 grade, and if you were to compare him to the best running backs of the last five years, I have him behind Ezekiel Elliott who went 4th overall to the Cowboys, and slightly ahead of Todd Gurley who went 10th overall to the St. Louis Rams. In the top 10, I see a number of teams that would love his ability. The New York Jets at number 6 and Carolina Panthers at number 8 are most likely in my opinion. With the Panthers, for example, he would be at his best running toss and power plays with their pulling offensive linemen. He could fit a pure zone running team based on his talent, but he looks much more comfortable when LSU ran gap style plays instead. Well that's all I have for you. If you like this video and you want to support the channel, feel free to follow the links to my PayPal and my Patreon accounts. You can follow me on Twitter at SamuelRGold. If you want more analysis of your favorite players, come to fieldgoals.com for our latest articles.